Scar, you are now under arrest for committing multiple felonies in Huang Long. Do you have anything to say? What do I want to say, huh? While I'd love to tell you another story, I guess that's not what you want to hear. Let's cut to the chase, Madam Magistrate. I'm getting bored already. Very well. You will answer only our questions from now on. Sure, why not? What do you want to know? A sentinel such as Jue can predict and correct future events. It gets in our way of achieving our sublime vision. We merely wanted to topple the set future built on lies and take control of our own destiny. Sure, why not? What do you want to know? The Thranodians. They hold the key to our ideal. Together, they will bring us the promised true lament. And we will embrace the new world that is bound to come. Sure, why not? What do you want to know? What is the lament? Disaster? Curse? Some kind of punishment? <laughs> People only see the surface. The lament brings death, destruction, and countless reverberations. Reverberations that will be reflected, overlapped, and interwoven during the lament. They will be our salvation. The only path to a new life form and a new civilization. Sure, why not? What do you want to know? Our goal has always been the same. We want you. Want you to join us. Too bad. We will then be forced to kill you by any means necessary. But I'm sure you'll willingly come to us when the time arrives. Sure, why not? What do you want to know? Our goal has always been the same. We want you. Want you to join us. Forces battle over you, causing all this strife. And yet you remain unaware of your own worth. Are you really that naive? Or are you just dense? Whatever. Our interest in you is not affected by such trivial matters. Sure, why not? What do you want to know? You kidnapped Jue and revived the Thranodian, accelerating the next lament. This is proof enough that you are the enemy of Jinjo and all humanity. Stop dreaming you can force Rover to join you. She is our honored guest, and I will not allow any harm to come her way. <laughs> How confident you sound. As the Thranodian's resurrection approaches, Jinjo is Barely holding on. How much longer do you think you can keep up this facade? Thank you for your concern. We have crushed your schemes once, and we can do it again. I have one last question for you. Abducting Jue, stalking Rover, and setting up an ambush in Cheecher Village. You couldn't have accomplished that all on your own. Unless... Unless I'm not the only overseer in Jinjo, right? <laughs> uh, 
I have answered all your questions with full honesty. I don't mind you knowing because it won't make any difference. You can try to stop us with all you have, but it's too late to change the course of history. Now, I have one question for you. You seem convinced we caused the disappearance of Jue. What if I told you there was more to it? Would you be curious? About Jue. What else do you know? Come closer and I'll tell you, Madam Magistrate. It's a secret for your ears only. How dare you! Madam Magistrate, I do... more. What if I told you your sentinel had made this prophecy a long, long time ago? Your all-seeing sentinel abandons you now of all times. Need I say more? We're merely adding a touch of extra fuel to the fire that will soon consume all. Rover, care for a wager? I know you've been searching for answers about your past, and I've got news for you. Watch out! You are one of us, the Black Lambs, and you have been chosen to join us, ushering in the new world. Once you discover what you really are, you will come to us with no hesitation. The Fraxidus awaits your arrival with open arms, and I look forward to that day in sincere anticipation. <laughs> Rover, what he mentioned about our sentinel is highly sensitive. I cannot disclose it yet, not before verifying it myself. Is it a ploy to create distrust among us, or... <sighs> I must first find our sentinel to uncover the truth. Jue is the guardian sentinel of Jin Zhou. It is responsible for assisting Jin Zhou's magistrate in administrative affairs. While I am the final decision maker, without the assistance of Jue, I cannot guarantee I am always making the best choices for my people. Jue can predict the future, and up to this point, every one of its prophecies have been proven true. While justice may not be universally agreed upon, its decisions have consistently served the best interests of Huang Long. For that, I suppose we will have to talk to it in person to find out. In addition, Rover, Jue once told me to deliver a message to you, to the Awakened One. When raindrops fall upstream, please head to the Northfall Barrens and seek General Jian of the Midnight Rangers. I suppose so. General Jian is currently battling another TD outbreak in the Northfall Barrens, which will also serve as our front line against the Thranodian. But the ongoing war has made it a very dangerous place to go. Since you won't need to go there right now, not until when the raindrops fall upstream. I know you're here for clues about your true identity. And I don't want you to leave the city empty-handed. Have you heard about the Black Shores, Rover? 
It's an organization shrouded in mystery, with a secretive membership process and members who usually keep their identities hidden. Upon your awakening, one of their members discreetly contacted me to gather information about you. But please don't worry. The Black Shores developed a special lament prediction system and has established partnerships with countries worldwide. While operating in secrecy, they are not an extremist group like the Fraxidus. They have been monitoring the situation in Jinjo to provide assistance when needed. Thanks to their extra help, my meeting with you went smoothly. This Blake Bloom is their symbol. The Black Shores members usually wear it on their person. The Black Shores once provided us significant insights into the relationship between the Moon and the Thranodians. This time, they've come to inform us a Thranodian is about to resurrect near Jinjo. Apart from that, I'm not sure what else they may be hoping to achieve. This photo is yours to keep. I will return with Jue shortly, and the Black Shores may be worth your try during this time. Rover, are you all right? I see. The Black Shores must have a deep connection to your past. Since you are likely being closely monitored by the Fraxidus now, I suggest keeping an eye out for the Black Shore members. They could prove to be your valuable allies. I'll do my best to find Jue and tell you everything I learned from it once I return. This is my promise. Yes, please leave it to me. Sanhua. Yes, Madam Magistrate. I will be going on a temporary leave. During my absence, Please help me handle my responsibilities in Jinjo. Understood. Should I continue protecting that rover? No need. Both Chan Li and I will be away, and there will be more than enough paperwork for you to handle. Is Lady Chong Li leaving for the capital? Please pardon my intrusion, but she just faced an ambush in the Central Plains. What if... Regarding that incident, we tried to warn her about the Fraxidus, but they were more cunning than we thought. If she runs into another powerful enemy like Scar, she'll eventually have to confront them on her own. Sanhua. You can place more trust in Rover and me. Understood. I will. My lady, no matter what happens, my sword is always yours. The interrogation and my appointed meeting with Rover have already finished. Scar only needed the two of you as his audience. We already knew what he wanted, and we let him have as much. She decrypted every message we intended to convey. It's only proper you meet him in person, as the one who crafted those puzzles. 
Such intricate puzzles. I guess only Rover has the patience to solve them all. No detail is too small. I'm sure she understands. Besides, not seeing the opponent heightens the thrill of the game. If everything goes according to the prophecies of Jue, I will meet her in person eventually. So, what did our captive from the Fraxidus tell you about Jue? That Jue had predicted I will have to fight it one day. A fight that will shape Jinjo's future. Well, that is... Unexpected. But you don't seem all that surprised, do you? Can't say I am. I had suspected as much from our previous conversations, and the message it left me. His words only confirmed it. Where was it when you last sensed its presence? It was... In Mount Firmament, unlike Jinjo City, that mountain is still resting in stillness. The place where the first people of Jinjo lived, and where Jue first manifested before us humans. I see. I'll find Jue, and bring it back as soon as possible. Our enemies could have planned it as a trap. We have a bigger goal to focus on, remember? I understand. I will not let anything or anyone disrupt the peace in Jinjo. Would you let what you heard from Scar sway your determination? No. He cannot ever turn me against Chue. If anything, his words only confirmed my theory. I am the Magistrate of Jinjo. Appointed by the Sentinel itself, the prophecy speaks of a decisive incident for Jinjo's future, where I will be a key player. The fight between me and Jue is only a precursor. My job remains unchanged. I will fulfill my duty as Jinjo's magistrate with my own judgment. Is that your final answer? A single strand's neglect births mountainous upheaval. You taught me that, remember? The safest option is for me to go in person. Very well. Since we are already mid-game, I will let you decide our next move. This time, I shall be a pawn in your hand. Remember, I will always stand by your side, in this crisis or any other. Am I a player or a mere pawn? I suppose there is no difference at this point. No matter what, I will do what I must. <laughs> 